I'd uh, like to start by congratulating both of our councils in securing the investment of the new road across Firepool. Hopefully this will end the blight of the derelict site and it will also take traffic away from the town centre. This council has invested heavily in the core strategy development plan, a blueprint for zoning areas for housing, while zoning other areas for protection from development. Councillor Edwards, through something he calls prematurity, uh, has recognised that the number of speckled developments in villages on urban green wedges is causing widespread cynicism and anger. Last week there was a meeting with the MP Bernie Brown. He made a complaint that the government promises to respect local plans are seen as hollow here in Taunton Dean. He also noted that an expert analysis using the latest government figures showed this council's 2008 estimate for the building of 17,000 new houses to be out of date and significantly overstated. We need our council to ensure that our local plan has precedent for the federal developments and it is based upon the latest information. I also welcome the leader's announcement for a town centre rethink in response to the banking crisis and subsequent recession. Our local businesses clearly need strong voice, but I hope that the consultation will be able to everyone, perhaps through the sort of being a consultation portal or even the Gazette. I'm less sanguine about this council's finances than the leader reported, and the finance director used quite strong language last week. She said, the picture, looking longer term, is very serious with a budget gap totaling nearly 4.5 million over the next three budget years. I still remain sceptical of the West Somerset sharing proposal. I feel it lacks ambition and scale, and it will be dependent on repatriating IT systems from South West One, with added risk and its reported cost of some 1.2 million. The Council Council sensibly shares offices with district councils in Bridgewater, Shepton, Mallet and Williton. Why then is there no significant office sharing by the two councils based here in Taunton? The Gazette reports that the County Council will have two spare blocks available at the County Hall, so why not share offices now? With a 4.5 million budget shortfall and a new 5.4 million swimming pool to finance, how can this cash strapped council afford to buy contact house, which is up by the library? And the council's financial position is of course not helped by the continuing shortfalls in savings from the controversial South West One joint venture with IBM. Last week's scrutiny report showed that after six years in contract with IBM, 1.8 million has been saved, and the offers of report, it is not yet clear how the lower savings target of 5.7 million will be achieved. Uh, in her report, Councillor Scott Williams reports that IBM is selling a large part of its global services business to a little known company called Sinex, and um, that's not to be confused with this stuff you probably know. Um, Whilst Taunton Dean is now following the Somerset County Council's lead in reducing services in South West One, I'm afraid the Sinex disposal has another period of uncertainty and risk. Thank you, Madam Chair. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you.